Which is bigger, e to the pi or pi to the e? Let's find out. Start by plotting the function y equals 1 over x, which is a decreasing function that looks like this. Now plot the point x equals e and draw a line to the graph. And note that pi is greater than e, so we can draw this line to the graph. The area under the curve between e and pi is represented by the integral from e to pi of 1 over x dx. Because the function is decreasing, the rectangle with height 1 over e lying over the interval e to pi has an area greater than the area under the curve, which is the definite integral. Notice that the definite integral is natural log of pi minus 1, and the area of the rectangle can be simplified to pi over e minus 1. But this implies that the natural log of pi is less than or equal to pi over e. Multiplying both sides by e shows us that e times the natural log of pi is less than or equal to pi. And applying natural log rules twice eventually leads us to the fact that pi to the e is less than or equal to e to the pi. So there you have it. We used calculus on the curve y equals 1 over x to convince ourselves that pi to the e is less than or equal to e to the pi.